What are we doing? Good morning. <laughs> we're, we're making BTOL. <laughs> we're still editing Bully O Line, and now we have to film the next one. <laughs> oh, God. Happy Monday. Happy Monday. I am perfectly capable of doing everything I need to do in the next three weeks. I am perfectly capable <laughs> of doing everything I need to do in the next three weeks. <laughs> oh God, help us all. About to leave for my very first appointment for my weight loss business. And I just wanted to look at myself and I'm just, I'm actually very happy with the way I look. What do you think? I think the tie's a little unnecessary, but this needs to go down. I have to keep tucking the shirt behind me so it doesn't look so big, but... Ugh, it's 36. I don't like that. We'll get there. Yes, we will. I've spent the entire day answering YouTube messages. Lists. I am the list queen. Uh, it's my way of life. I just dropped Jason off at the airport, so now I have the van! Ah! <laughs> Yay! So, I'm actually gonna go home and work right now. Very exciting. But still, I have a van. Just landed in Arizona. I'm not telling you where I'm going yet. I guess I never realized, like, I never really realized what a difference to moving walkways made. I'm not walking on them. It took me, like, forever to get to where I want to go, but I don't feel that lazy anymore. So, it's a long ass corridor. And we're in Texas. Surprise, I'm going to Texas to stay with my home for a couple days. First time here, I got another boring airport. BTYL Superstar! Look, these are all the people that are watching my, my spiral into hell right here. Now do it. Shot, shot, shot. Look, you're all saying shot. You fucking whore. Sorry, I got really shot, excited. Shot, 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 shot. Really excited. Ah! Ah! This is more than a shot. This is like a shot and a half. <laughs> so what? You can handle it? We're supposed to. <laughs> <laughs> We're supposed to do. Fucking lush. <laughs> Texas. Is it what I expected? I don't know. I had a great first night here. I really did. The night ended with me. Revisiting some feelings from another time that I like to revisit. 2009 being this year where, yes, it's a great year, but it's the year of change. So, lots of changes have been made. Then things all started going crazy. And crazy, and crazy, and crazier, and crazier, and crazier. And now it's like we're in the resolution of the year because we're almost done. I think it's time to blog it out, bitch. Here's a camera angle you're not used to seeing on Nicole. Her actual desk. She's concerned that I'm a homosexual, and I'm wearing this shirt. Oh my god! It's like he wants to be stoned in public here. I keep telling him it's scary. Day two of being extremely productive. I'm getting ready to do my blog TV show coming up in 15 minutes, and I'm very excited. Um, feeling good. It's a good day. I love when I just sort of feel on top of things. I feel like... I can handle this now. <laughs> I've been thinking about this for a while And I've been thinking about this now for quite some time Now I think I finally figured out I want you Right here in my life I've been going this over in my head all from the time that I wake up to the time that I go to bed When I add it all up, I find that in the end I want you Yes, I do Alright, we're gonna try this difficult feat of uh, relaying <laughs> While she's filming, so if the camera goes so whoosh, 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 whoosh. Apologies in advance <laughs> I hope you say you want me to I hope that you say you want me to I hope that you say you want me to I hope that you say you want me to I know that I'm plenty full of faults I know it's pretty clear Perfect man is something that I'm not But you bring out the good in me in April 
try to see that I need you. Try this one more time. It's five in the morning. Don't go <laughs> pieces of cheesecake. I need sleep. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the lesson for all of you. The less you sleep, the more your decision making is just oh. Well, yeah. Cheesecake for breakfast is never a good decision. It smells like shit out here. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Texas. <laughs> It's crazy when you go into a place and it's pitch black and you come out and it's like, what? Where am I? <laughs> Where is this place? Ugh. Piggy, piggy! Frumpy, dumpy, piggy. What this is, is sick, I'm being infected. You're being infected? Ugh. Ugh. I feel like a homeless person. You look like a homeless person. You're walking <laughs> around in a sweatshirt with gum on your pants <laughs> and with a guy who looks like he rolled out of bed 15 days ago and hasn't showered yet. <laughs> With acne all over his forehead and an eye that looks like I've been punched in the face. <laughs> I just finished watching the documentary Spirit of the Marathon. <laughs> I think it is possibly the most inspiring movie I've ever seen. If you want to be a runner someday, get that movie. Spirit of the Marathon. This is the ugliest fucking thing I've ever seen in my entire life. What do you think of Texas, Jason? I don't have a, I don't have, I have no words. I don't hate it, but... That bad. It's just like... That is the future of America. This is his life. <laughs> yeah, this is my exciting life. Cat, friends, and food all the time. Robert, everyone below the O-line thinks you're shy and don't like to talk. How do you respond to that? You're not going to talk or say anything? <laughs> pretty accurate. Slowly making progress on my apartment. Something that's been long overdue. We're getting there. Sunday. Back to reality. Kind of. <laughs> You'll see at the end of this, like, exactly, exactly how terrible this week has gone. And that's if I'm measuring it in terms of caloric intake. Uh, emotionally, I think this week's been very empowering and good, honestly, but you wouldn't see that because you only see what I choose to push to record, so... That's all I really can say. I'm not going to sit here and say I'm going to get back on track immediately. Although I am, but I'm not going to make any promises. And I'm not going to sit here and chastise myself. And nor should you. It's about my life. It's about Shanti's life. It's about the lives of people that know us or interact with us. So we went and saw the fantastic Mr. Fox. One of the best movies ever made. It was amazing. It was moving and hilarious and perfect and quirky and amazing. And then we saw 2012, which was a disaster. In more ways than one. In more ways than one. One of the worst pieces of trash ever put in the film. No, it was great trash, though. It was really great trash. <laughs> It was horrible, but it was really? beautiful. Exactly. <laughs> if we can't close the door, then we can't start the engine. If we can't start the engine, we're going to hit Mount Everest. Oh my God. <laughs> really? Really?